physically and spiritually and therefore I believe that now spiritual we are going to Malatena and we are going to be able to get the money and we are going to be able to get the money Mazuri jameni na usio sana ambako nigeweza kumualika chief officer wa finance abaya naitua CPA eh, William Kimani sana sana hii mamu ili akaweze kutupa mustasari wa mahali tumetoka mahali tumefika Mazuri Nancy and your team because when we start Your Excellency our governor Ya kwamba those years may have gone but those years we have a plan to recover them and we shall recover them by accelerating the pace of work i came to office here last year in august i found in this county in our bank account we had a deficit, a debt of close to a billion on anything we would have wanted to do at that particular. Indeed, my friends, my, my, my fellow countrymen, indeed, salaries we were paying on debt triple. And my CFO is there, he can tell you. The CC finance is here. That Salaries to be paid for one month. We were, we were taking on an overdraft over another two overdrafts for one month to pay. That means to, to pay them for one month, I would be having a debt of 750 million times three. That's the, that's the situation, there it was. I came here and I found pending bills of more than seven billion. Every facility, and we have got about 153 facilities, medical facilities in Kiambu County. Indeed, by the way, for those who don't know, Kiambu County has the highest number of medical facilities in the Republic of Kenya. All those medical facilities, to take even a tablet of aspirin, when we came in, it had be, to be taken on credit, on debt. Now in our medical facilities, for any procurement you want to do, in our account this week, we are able to write a check of half a billion without anybody asking us a question. I have paid every single person who works in this county, any area they ever had, 100%, and to take it even forward, that... We have even now paid people graduate, graduate for time accrued even before they leave office. Kiambu County, tulikuwa tunakuwa ranked number 47 out of 47. For those of you that remember, that was our rank when I came in. 47 out of 47. I was hoping they would come in December. Wapate kwanza tumepanga vile sisi tumewekelea mipango yetu. By December, they, sh they would have told and they will tell a different story. Because we are not going to be number three. We are going to be number one overall in every aspect. Uh, kama vila mwanjua, um, hatuwezi kaenderea kama hatuna mpangiria mwafaka. Nga ambao ungetutusaidia kuwa na utaratibu wa kupiga hatua moja kwa ingine. Kwa hivyo, siku ya leo, ilikuwa uzinduzi huo. Na sisi mimi kam, kama mbonge wa ruiru. Nikaona ni vizuri, nione ni wapi loiro imehushisho katika maendeleo ya eneo um, letu uh, la kiambu. Na sisi tuko hapa kusema tutaendelea kumunga mkono katika maendeleo ya gatuzi letu la kiambu na hasa uh, eneo mbunge la loiro ambalo liriro na watu wengi kuliko eneo lingine uh, katika gatuzi hili, uh, gatuzi ambayo ina... Um, maeneo mbunge kumi na mawili. Na kati ya yale kumi na mawili, lile lililo na watu wengi 
uh, ni Ruiru na sasa watu ni karibu laki saba uh, na ndio eneo mbunge lililo na watu wengi wapika kura katika Kenya nzima. Kwa hivyo mimi hapa ni kuja kwa kilisha eneo bunge langu uh, la Ruiru ambalo uh, limekuwa na changamoto ya uh, maendeleo na kuja kwangu hapa ni kuhakikisha uh, tumehushishwa kimaendeleo katika gatuzi letu.